Rodias now reports that the Guyana Forestry Commission has received funding from Norway. The first tranche of the U.S. $6.63 million funding has been released through Conservation International for the GSC to continue with the implementation of the second phase of the Guyana Red Plus monitoring and verification system. In implementing the MRV, I think to summarize it effectively, it will be moving from just being a data source to being an information source. That is what we hope the second phase will be. So we're not only giving out data in terms of percentages and numbers and statistics, but we'll be translating this to information and hopefully information that can help to fuel decision making. The MRVS is the single largest project undertaken by the GFC and will be funded until 2020. Pradeepa Bolanot said the key challenge to implementing this new phase of the MRVS is time. That has been one of the challenges that plagued us in the first phase, which we have to overcome in this phase. Guyana has maintained its leadership internationally under the Red Plus initiative to keep carbon emissions low through forest conservation. We are very happy uh, with the way in which this uh, process um, is managed. Guyana's MRVS dates back to 1990 and tracks changes in the forest cover. The agreement between Guyana and Norway began formally in 2009. For Info Hub, Tiffany Rogers.